Hey, what's up guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to a quick middle part right here of our Pokemon Coliseum walkthrough. So, as you guys can see, the game looks a little bit better than what it initially did. <laughs> and that is because I actually found um, a way to play Pokemon Coliseum through game card or through, uh, what was it called, through an emulator right here onto my computer. So, one Christmas morning, or New Year's morning, I believe, I don't know, whichever one it was, yes, I actually got curious on how to actually play the Nintendo GameCube through emulator and, and find out if, it, if it's safe enough to do it right here onto my computer. And, you know, after quite some time, I actually found it. And it turns out that, look at this, we got a good, clean, nice, crisp visual right here. And the reason I'm doing this is because, well, after recording my Nintendo GameCube through my Elgato capture card right here, I didn't necessarily like the way it looked. Oh, crud. <laughs> I didn't necessarily look like the way it looked going into um, the recording process right here for the very first episode of our Pokemon uh, Coliseum Walker. So that's what inspired me to get to get to work on finding an emulator. And I actually found both the emulator for Pokemon Coliseum and Pokemon X the Gale of Darkness. So that means continuing on forward right here guys, we will be playing Pokemon uh, Pokemon Coliseum through the GameCube or through the GameCube emulator called Dolphin 5.0. If anything happens like I don't know something cock maybe that I don't know of of this whole emulator then you know it no worries I am actually gonna be playing Pokemon Coliseum via my GameCube right here just to make sure that you know Nothing screwy happens and all that stuff. As you guys already uh, can see right here, I'm actually playing a single battle. And it's something that's being offered right here onto the Pokemon Coliseum. I'm just trying out the whole thing, and so far I am actually liking it. I mean, uh, just, look at the, just look at the graphics in general. It's uh, nice and crisp for you guys. So, from uh, well, moving on forward right here, every single weekend, yes, we will be having... Uh, we will be having Pokemon Coliseum right here on the Dolphin emulator. So I hope every single one of you guys like what, what what's going on right now. Um, right now it's currently like two in the morning. I'm trying to figure out how to like make sure I get everything crisp and, and, and ready to go. Um, as always, I, I always have the worry that the that the emulator might not work just because, well, you know, of something that I don't know of. I've been playing the Desmume, the BBA for a long time, but I know the ins and outs to this whole, uh, for the emulator, that the dolphin right here is one of those things that I'm just gonna have to, I'm just gonna have to keep my eye, eyes peeled. That's why I'm saying, playing Pokemon Coliseum via, you know, the GameCube, we will see, especially with like Nintendo 64's version. So, there you go, guys. We want our first game right here. And this guy's telling us that you learned well. <laughs> wow. Okay, so... It turns out that I only used one Pokemon right here, so that's, uh... <laughs> I guess you could say that's our very first victory right there. We're gonna exit this battle, and... Well, as you guys can see, you can play either single or double battle, random Pokemon, and... Like I said, guys... In the next episode, you will have a nice, crisp, and clean episode of Pokemon Coliseum. Thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for being supportive. I will see you guys in the next episode on Saturday. Actually, I lie. On Sunday, as we continue our adventure right here on Pokemon Coliseum. See you guys.